do you know what type of soil you have? If your soil has a gritty texture and it drains and dries out quickly, it's high in sand. The pros of having sandy soil are it's loose, so it's great to grow things like carrots with large tap roots. It's also great for planting things that don't like having wet roots. The cons are sandy soil doesn't hold on to water or nutrients very well. If your soil has a smooth and flowery texture and holds on to water pretty well, it's high in silt. Soils high in silt are great at balancing water retention and water drainage. They're also much better at holding nutrients than sandy soils. But these types of soils are prone to erosion and compaction. If your soil is sticky, doesn't drain very well, and very hard when it's dry, it's high in clay. Although clay soils tend to hold on to excess water and compact extremely easily, they're also the best at holding on to nutrients. Most soils contain sand, silt, and clay in varying amounts, but if you have equal parts of all three, consider yourself lucky. You have what's called loam and this is considered the ideal soil to grow most things. All of these soils can successfully grow plants, but certain types of plants prefer certain types of soil. So do your research before planting something new. Find out what it likes. With sandy soils, you'll probably need to water and fertilize more often. On the flip side, clay soils can easily become overwatered and nutrient levels can get too high if we're over fertilizing. 